here at Haynes Point, the water is very muddy, lots of logs, logs everywhere, logs, branches, very poor fishing conditions, but I decided to give it a try anyway. Two of my poles were tangled up on a tree branch. After I untangled the poles, my second pole had this. Not one, but two huge, massive channel cats. Look at that. Even in these horrible conditions. If you know how to fish, you can go out and get them. Look at that. Massive. Look at that one, just a big hog. I'd say that's the daddy and that's the son. All on the same pole. My husband bought me this pole. I love it. 30 pound braided test on here, I believe. And that's what you have. Haynes Point. What did they bite? I think they I had on there two, no, one squid bait and one chicken liver bait. Beautiful. Just hogs. Just hogs. Brilliant. Look at that one. Okay, friends. Signing off. Hey friends, here this morning, out here at Downs Park in Pasadena, Maryland. The water's nice, it's about noon. Crab boats are out. The gentleman just helped me land this one. Nice channel cat. Very nice. He's a hog, look at that. I think he's more of a flathead than a channel. He looks like a flathead, the more I look at him. But he's a hog. Let's flip him so you can get a side view of what he's looking like. That'll make some nice catfish steaks. Yeah. Our signing off, friends. Downs Park, Pasadena, Maryland. Out here getting it. We're here at Centennial Lake, Howard County, and my baby is trying out his new kayak mm -hmm. and his new life jacket. Poppy, what are you gonna do today? Huh? What do you what do you what are you gonna do today? I like this canoe. I like I it. it <laughs> I think it's a kayak. Huh? How does it feel? Is it comfortable? I feel very comfortable. Be careful. I can do like this and I feel like I'm gonna fall. Good, good. Use my legs feel a little weird. I think I have to stretch it up like this. Yeah, stretch your legs out. Yeah. You got a lot of room. Oh nice. Ooh. Huh? Let me see you turn in a circle. Wow. How fun. Bye bye. Don't forget your whistle. Huh? Blow your whistle if you need me to come save you. Okay. Bye.
Hi friends. We're here at the bay, Chesapeake Bay. We're actually on the other side of the bay, opposite Sandy Point. Sandy Point, there is the Bay Bridge. And there's Sandy Point on the other side of the bridge. We're actually um, east of Sandy Point. We're on the, we've passed over the Bay Bridge and we're on the opposite side on a little beach in a little park in Queens and County. We're right on the boundary of the park where they allow fishing. It's really a swimming beach. Come out and swim, but we're right on the edge so you can fish along this area. Right along this area, it's very nice. Actually, it's, to me, it's better than Sandy Point. It's not crowded. Very few people here, some families are here, but you're not crowded. There's no lifeguard over on this side, but the water, there seems to be a sandbar out in the water where you can relatively walk, I would say about 100 feet out. There's my baby walking out. So the fishermen today are saying that if you walk out as far as you can walk, I guess when the water gets to your neck, you can um, throw your fishing pole out and you have better chance of catching something. There's been reports of spots, um, some striped bass, better known as rockfish, and Kroger. My baby caught some spot and caught and release. We're just catching and release, having fun. You see over here, some more gentlemen have walked out and they're fishing. And there's my baby out there, all the way out there. The water is almost up to his shoulder. He's got his brand new pole. I think it's about 13 feet. New reel, 80 pound test. Trying it out here. We actually tried it last night, overnight, at Chop Tank. Kind of cool last night. Um, hit a couple things big. Um, my pole broke, or my line broke, and it got away. It was either a skate, or a really nice rockfish. I was disappointed we couldn't land it, but it's like that sometimes. just really out here at this park I'll have to come back and tell, tell you the name of this park I forgot the name of oh Terrapin that's it Terrapin Park Terrapin Park Nature Reserve right here at Queen Anne's County opposite side of the bay from Sandy Point there's the Bay Bridge here's our fishing park today fishing cart. Really just really kind of a secluded little beach area. There's a walking trail. You can ride your bike. There's really no fishing allowed. But if you come all the way down to the end of this um, nature reserve in this park, you can fish along this part of the bank where people aren't um, swimming. So you see the, bo the, the concrete b uh, borders right here, barriers, so you can fish along here. And there's my baby still out there in the water. Okay. He's still out there. Let's see how long it takes for him to come back in. The temperature is about 80, between 80 and 82 degrees. It really warmed up. It was really cool this morning and early afternoon. So we just got up to 82, 83 degrees. It's a nice area. 
families are out here. The water is very shallow. I see little kids playing in the water. Just really shallow. There's a huge sandbar. I think it stretches about, like I said, 100 yards out. We've watched some bald eagles swoop down. Some ospreys, seagulls. It's a beautiful little park. Very quiet, not overcrowded. I like this a lot better than Sandy Point. No tangles. It's really nice. I'm going to show you all the, the TV. Santos out there. I'm gonna walk and show you the TP that he built. A little shaded TP. There we go. I'm gonna walk around it. Got a little TP area. Nice little shaded area. We didn't bring a lot of things out. Blanket, our bait cooler, our bag. It's just too cold. So really just having a real casual, relaxing afternoon. Okay. Be back with you in a minute, friends. Hey friends, I'm back with you. My baby's walking back in. He launched a pole, a fishing pole, about 100 yards out. Between here and the beach, between here, the beach, and the, um, about 100 yards out is a sandbar. So you literally can walk out over 100 feet and the water is just right at your shoulders. So the best results that we've found today is that if you walk out right to the edge of this sandbar and then um, toss your line out, the better chance is that you're gonna get something nice. We saw a couple of uh, fishermen catch some rockfish out here today, some spot and um, some croakers. Not many croakers, but um, some nice some keepers. So he's, my baby's bringing it back in. I don't know what that is. It looks like a hermit crab. Looks like he's found a hermit crab. Those things look like dinosaurs. So he's walking the line back in. I'm sure he's used all the line on the reel. So he's bringing it in. Papi, what's the, how does the water feel? How does the water feel? Is it warm? Is it cold? Is it that cold? I don't think it's that cold. Oh, it's colder the deeper you go out? Okay. Well, I was telling the friends that you caught some spot. We threw them back. We just having fun out here today. Right. Yeah. I showed them the teepee that you made with our blanket. <laughs> It's a nice tea for you keeping it, keeping the sun off our heads. And so I have to get the right camping stuff. That's all I can say. Well, that's okay. Well, it, there's some drones out here. Hey, hey, friends, do you see this drone up here? I don't know if I. 
airplane. Is that an airplane? Oh, I thought it was a drone. <laughs> Oh, I saw a drone earlier. I think it's gonna be. Oh yeah, that is an airplane. Sorry, friends. There's the Bay Bridge. Traffic starting to back up a little bit on the Bay Bridge. Yeah, much nicer out over on this side of um, the Bay than Sandy Point. Well, anything you want to say, babe, before we sign off? I want to say thank you to my family. Thank you to my wife. Thank you for every each individual who uh, really love me and really care about me. And say hi to my co-workers. And have a good, good and blessed life. You have to enjoy life. It's, it's very short. Bye. Bye, friends.